Hey y'all, Mythic Rare here, and thank you to all my A1 Day 1 subscribers. For anybody new or is just passing through, welcome. So today we have the unboxing from a new to me company called Fallon Gems. Their owner, Crimson, reached out to me in my DMs in Instagram, and she has a licensed diamond painting company that aims to provide a creative outlet for stress and anxiety through their unique and therapeutic diamond art kits. And she asked me to be affiliate and like, are you interested? So yes, uh, in full disclosure, I, I am very much interested in her diamond paintings. Um, I got a few kits for 40% off and uh, she did give me a free mini diamond painting as like a gift with purchase and she has like a ton of really really cute ones like i got the feud by coffee and chaos one like there's tons of like very cute ones from like a fantasy like fairy tale castle and lots of nice landscapes to like everything snarky for the hilarity and things for the mental health and like all in between. So I highly, highly suggest that you check her out and see what Fallon Gems has to offer. Uh, for those of you who are wondering because this... Um, is a very new shop. Uh, they do offer licensed artwork. So that is like huge to me. Uh, without further ado, let's get right on into it, shall we? I like could not find my scissors. So and I know it was packaged in a bubble boot when it shipped from their factory in China. So I am just like trying my with like utmost caution to like not pop anything because that would really, really hurt. <laughs> I did receive uh, two different tracking numbers. I don't know if that was because, like, it's from China going to the U.S. or if it's because I have the free gift with purchase. But I'm just like, this is incredibly light. I can't believe that there are th three in here. Uh, oh, okay. Like, that is interesting. I haven't received one in a bubble boot in a minute. I know some of y'all are just like, cut the thing, mythic, cut the thing. But I want to be careful, so <laughs> here it goes. Okay. Oh, I probably should have warned y'all before I did that. Um, okay. Ooh, these come individually bagged. So I think that my other two canvases are gonna be uh, coming later, or maybe they're in there. I don't know, we will have to see, but there is our color palette and this is going to say, be kind to your mind. Love it. And here is what their toolkit is. You've got your wax, your standard white boat. You've got some baggies. Ooh, you get tweezers. That's nice. And you get a comfort grip. It looks like there's a five placer and a nine placer, I think. Just going to guess 
And I'm not really seeing any numbers on the end of those. But you do get two multi-placers, so that's nice. Oh, you know what, actually? I think that my other canvases are going to come later because there's a foam core. Man, it has been a minute since I had received one with a foam core. Oh, I think I know why they came as two separate ones. They must do their premium canvases as one batch, and then they do the budget-friendly or the regular option as another batch. I love the fact that this is a velvet canvas, although... Um, some feedback that I am going to have right away is just be careful what kind of tape you use because as I was trying to get rid of the tape, like, it started to come apart right here. So in case anybody does order the velvet canvas, you may just want to cut it instead and then just, like, leave some of the tape remaining. But oh my god, this is poured glue. Oh, she was rolled up tight, y'all. I am going to have to roll her backwards. Okay, can y'all see that? Yeah, you can. Maybe we're just a tad crooked. Yep, okay, it's wanting to curl, but you know what, it's, it's fine. So, be kind to your mind. And... Oh! It's actually... The sticky actually feels really, really good. I think it's just going to continuously be curled up like that for a minute because <laughs> it was curled all the way like that from its ride into China. Uh, we do have a legend right here. And... We have another legend right here. The symbols are actually really, really clear. And then up at the top, we have our branding Fallon Gems. So actually, you know what, let me take you down into the business some more. There we go. Now I feel like that gave us a really, really good close up. I'm just gonna scoot you all over. There we go. Um, all right. So it looks like there is nothing else inside the package, but what we do get is a inventory sheet. Um, mind your earbuds. I'm going to open this up and then I'm going to like just briefly go over the colors and take a peek at that inventory sheet.
Okay, so you get your list of colors, your quantity, and then like how many bags of each one. And then here's your step-by-step -step instructions. You're going to pick out the corresponding bag, put your diamonds in the tray, and then you can use tweezers or a multi-placer to stick them down. And then you just want to make sure that they are fully secured to the canvas. Oh, I forgot that the premium kits were going to come with AVs. So that is a very pleasant surprise. Let's see. So this is AV741. So then AB741 is K's and King. I want to say that it is going to be in those lilies. Yes, indeed it is. So this is going to be all right in here in up in the lilies. Like yeah, that's going to be cool. All right. So then there is another AB 720. 720 was another color that we were going to see in the flowers as well. And then there are a few more. So there's 742. Man, those flowers, they're really going to pop. And then there is a FD3756. I have a feeling that the FD756 may, in fact, be glow-in-the-dark drills. Hang on just a second. Okay, so I didn't find anything on the listing, but if you take a look really closely, the FD... I want to call that Fallon dust or, you know, fairy dust as we know it by like the bigger shops. But oh my God, like you can see like just that little extra glimmer of something special. Like, yes, absolutely love it. Uh, so we found 740. We found 741, we found 742, 720, and we found the fairy dust. So there should be one more. Oh, I see it. Four one three. That is our other fairy dust. Oh, you know what? I bet that's in the words. Be kind to your mind. Okay, so 413 is number five. Oh, it's in the brain. It's in the brain. Number five is in the brain. Oh, and it's in like some of the, it's in some of the words too. Oh, that is going to be so cool. I cannot wait for my other kits to get here. Oh, my goodness. I know I'm, like, all bumping y'all a lot and stuff. And this is, like, kind of on the jankier side of unboxings that I have done. 
Um, but yeah, absolutely. Like this is just wow. Incredible. So yeah, I will have to be a little bit careful about the backside of the canvas just because I wasn't expecting the tape to hold that strongly and then like wanting to almost take part of the canvas with it but yeah like absolutely I cannot wait for my mini kit and then my other kit to get here I just like I saw this coming and I could not wait to get off of work like this just wow so yep this is a round and then other stats about the canvas is that it is a 50 by 50 and what I actually had just unboxed or unbagged rather was their premium toolkit. They have um, scalloped and finished edges. All of their kits, whether you're doing like the standard or the premium, they all come with poured glue. It's all licensed artwork, no matter which one you get. You do get a few um, added things like the tweezer, the upgraded pen and tray and stuff. And if you are more accustomed to ordering from the bigger shops, I mean, like, I don't need to list them off. We all know who they are at this point, pretty much. But if you are, like, used to any of the big boys and you're stumbling across them and this is the first time that you are ever purchasing from Fallon Gems, you probably want to go with your premium toolkit because it'll be more like the things that you're used to. Or if this, or if you've done, like, other budget kits from... Timu, Amazon, Wish, Shein, you name it, and you are tired of the edges fraying on your canvas, then that would actually be a really good choice for you to make. Even if this is your very first time purchasing that from them, like I've seen them run sales and stuff over the last few weeks while I've been waiting for my stuff to come here. So they are going to always have something that is more affordable for everybody. I honestly think that their premium toolkit is uh, not just a really good splurge, but if you think that you're gonna take up this hobby long term some of those tools like the tweezers and the comfort grip the boat like that would actually last you for a good while um and actually we are almost done with showing you the drills. I love how these are all pre-bagged. So if you have, if you're like me where you have like a million things started and like hardly anything finished, you're out of your storage space or whatever, you can just like toss these in a pencil box. Cause I mean, it's that time of year you can pick them up cheap cause they're uh, back to school season. <laughs> but yeah, you could just like do what I do, toss these in a pencil box and, um, and stuff while you 
finish your other kits if you're okay with working out of baggies but I mean that tray does have a funnel so if you want to pour that into storage jar storage containers hey by all means and oh my goodness like check out that fat pack of drills we obviously know what color is going to be in the background <laughs> And, you know, to like, just like at first glance too, the drills look really, really good. Um, you know, I do wish that the blue tape wouldn't have wanted to take part of the canvas with it. But so far, like, I actually have quite a few good things to say about this company. I will post a part two on my channel when the other diamond painting kits arrived because I did have two of them and they were actually the standard quality so that will be an interesting compare and contrast to this one that you just saw me unbox. Again this was Fallon Gems and I hope to work on more kits from them and unbox more things from them in the future. Thank you so much for watching all the way until the very end. If you've seen me more than once today, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you want to see more content from me. And if you like this video, go ahead and hit the thumbs up. It lets me know that I am doing something right as a creator. Thank you for spending part of your day with me and we will see you all later. Bye.